All right, good morning, everyone. Autumn is in the back with me, as usual. She is uh, riding around with Daddy today. Daddy has got to go, like, get up the street. So we're getting torn up by all these trucks coming up and down the street. Killing our street, man. Did you see what somebody did right there? Yeah. That was the guys who were moving people next door. They tore a hunk of the street out, really. So are you having a good day, my love? Yeah! I'm having a great day. I didn't have a great night. You had you had two two uh, episodes last night, Autumn, with night walking, and I had a really bad dream last night. I had a dream that we were inside a house, and I fell asleep in the house. And when I woke up, I was covered in cockroaches, the little ones, the little German cockroaches. The little scary ones. Don't, I mean, palmetto bugs, we're, we're Floridians. Or we're Floridians and we still frequent Florida. So we're not worried about palmetto bugs. Those little German cockroaches are the worst things. And in my dream, uh, I woke up from my dream and they were crawling all over me and they were in my hair. And I couldn't get them out of my hair. I was like shaking them, shaking them. And the more I shook, the more came back. And then eventually, I got them all out of my hair and you came and woke me up. You came and it was about four o'clock in the morning and you were having, you were sleepwalking and you woke me up, I took you to the bathroom and then you came and fell asleep at the edge of the bed and I went to sleep and when I went to sleep, I picked up the dream again where cockroaches were in my hair and your mom was there now, now my wife was there and she was brushing all the cockroaches out of my hair and they were just falling everywhere. Are you freaking out, obviously? Nobody wants cockroaches in their hair. You know what I mean? We don't go cockroaches, there's no cockroaches. I know we don't have any cockroaches around, but it was just a really bad dream. Just a really frightening dream. It felt like it lasted a minute or two. I don't know, you know how dreams are. They could last hours and they feel like a minute or two or vice versa. They could last a minute and they feel like they're forever. So that was kind of disturbing this morning. I took an extra long shower and didn't realize that my wife, because it's summertime now, she puts the hot water in like vacation setting. So, cause you don't need that much hot water. You're usually taking cold showers. So I didn't realize she put on vacation set. She must've, cause I turned on the hot water today and I jumped in. And I tell you, it was like it was like Scooby-Doo cartoon, cartoon. The way I jumped back out of that shower, I was freaking out. I thought I was gonna turn into an instant popsicle. So I turned the water all the way to the hot, and then the hot water came. I said, oh man, I'm thinking like the water tank's broken or something, you know? It's only maybe two years old. Ah, what a hassle today. I gotta drive around, call people, get a water tank out to the house. But it wasn't. So we are lucky. So we have hot water. It's just, it's just that it's uh, not super, super hot, you know, like burning hot. We don't have that for the summer. So we're heading out to Home Depot today. Got a project in uh, central Pittsburgh. Got to paint some bedrooms, one of the units. Got to rent it out this month. Uh, I got to paint some bedrooms, got to stain the kitchen. I almost forgot about the stain in the kitchen thing. Smart me, I remembered. And I was scared about your dream because I was so freaked out that I slept. I know, you came downstairs and you slept. You slept at the edge of the bed with me. Yeah, yeah. and you're like, Autumn, get out of the bed. And I think I was still asleep. Yeah, I had to get out of the bed because you were like all up in my, my, my feet area. I couldn't move my feet. I couldn't stretch out, and then I was freaking out in the dream, you know? And then you woke me up, because you woke up with your night like, terror, whatever you had. No, I was just waking up because you were like, bottom, and I didn't hear you, and then you woke up again. And then I asked you to woke me up. You woke me up. I didn't wake you up. Yeah, you guys sleep like gypsies, though. That's the problem, you know? You guys sleep like, like, you know, you live in a one-room flat. 
It's like I don't, it's like I'm not a normal person. I have scary. I, I'm scared in the house when I wake. I don't know what you're scared of. Then you should sleep more. You don't sleep enough. You or your sister. You guys don't sleep enough. That's a bad habit, you know? Especially when you go to school in a couple of months. You need to be awake in the morning and alert. Not groggy and sleepy. It is a nice day today, isn't it? Do you want a coffee at Home Depot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Go see everybody there. Go see the pro desk and say hi to Mike and Richard and Terry. Too bad they don't give out candy, huh? That'd be awesome. Candy or like pizza. You go in there and instead of coffee, they have like free slices of pizza. Why doesn't Home Depot do that? They could do that. They should feed their employees every day. Every day should be a pizza party day. They deserve it. Those people work hard. They really, most of them, some of them are bums, but most of them work hard, you know? It's like any other job. Like you work a lot hard. Yeah, I, I work hard. I work hard at what I do. I like what I do, though. Plus, I work hard at being a daddy, because I like being a daddy the best. That's my favorite part. Yep. Everything else, second. Kids first, right? Yeah. So playing first. Huh? Playing first. Playing first, yeah. That's my priority. Playing, kids, making lunches, then your mom gets squeezed in for a few minutes, and then everything else is work. That's it. Not that exciting of a life, huh? Although mommy and I are going to Vegas in a couple weeks. That's going to be great. Yeah, I can't yeah, wait for that. And you know what the best part is? What's the best part? Oh. She always takes us when we are babysitting. Yeah. She always takes us to get ice cream. Last year, she took us to ice cream. Yes, I know she did. She's going to take us to I know. Ice she, ice likes, she likes to get you guys ice cream. And there's this special place. Yeah. She just passed and she wants ice cream last year. Oh, well, that's, that's great. That's great. All right. Wow, look at that. Yeah. Ashley Furniture is getting built. Yeah. Wow, it really changed this plaza. It looks nice now. So we're going to go get some paint. We're going to go get some paint. Let me review. I need some ceiling paint. I already have bucket paint for the walls. Five gallons. Granite boulder. Always granite boulder. Uh, oh, I got a price flooring for the kitchen. 176 square feet. What else do we need? Roller covers. Paint roller covers. What else? I don't think there's that much else. No, my, my guys have mostly everything or they can get it from my warehouse. It's just the paint, really, and the stain. And I'm actually pretty sure I have a crap load of stain at my warehouse, which I'm going to have to go and check. Maybe after this. Go to the, we should have gone to the warehouse first. Anyway, yeah, so that dream, man. If anybody's ever had a dream like that, <clears throat> I know people have it with like spiders and stuff, and I think I've had spiders falling, you know, getting your lips cut off, Jason Voorhees, you know, Freddy Krueger, Michael Myers, Pinhead, Chucky, Leprechaun. Yeah, even the new Leprechaun, he's way scarier than Warwick Davis was. Warwick Davis was classic, but the new Leprechaun's crazy scary. That guy's like too, he's over the top. And then, what else is real scary? Chucky's the scariest. Uh, yeah, Chucky is pretty scary. He's a doll. It's crazy, you know? That a doll could attack you like that? I don't know. Not for me. I can't watch scary movies anymore. They scare me too much. I'm a big, I'm a big wimp now. Scary dreams oh, Baba Duke! Yeah, I don't know who gave you guys permission to go on the Netflix and watch Baba Duke. No I wouldn't even watch it. No one's Savannah put it on. 
Oh. No, 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 no. Well, they're, they shouldn't be playing with the remote. And, and now they know never to put on Bobby because they gave scary dreams. Well, and remember I mean, remember during your birthday party they put on scary movies and Jillian went home crying? Oh. I don't know if you remember that, but that's what happened. I had to go get Jillian from the house all the way up the street because she was so scared. And then Chrissy was mad because she thought we put on scary movies. I was like, no. Why would I put on a scary movie at a five-year-old's birthday party? Darf. And now, I'm going to tell Spin and Noah that they're not allowed to my birthday party. No, you can't tell them not allowed to the birthday party. You just tell them, just tell them, please don't touch my stuff. You know? No, I'm going to tell them not to go to my birthday party. There's actually a spot at the customer pro parking today. That's unbelievable. Just like, usually there's like four guys parking outside of it. <laughs> there's like 12 vehicles here. So we're gonna go in, we're gonna grab our paint. I just want to share that crazy dream with you. Maybe someone's had that dream and they can help me out because I don't know, I was wild. Feel free to leave your comments. Like, share, subscribe, CJ Goes Live. All that stuff, the Twitter and the Facebook and the Instagram and all the hashtags and Fire Nice products. Yeah! 50% up. Yeah. Up. <laughs> ah, my little partner. She knows what I'm going to say at the end of these videos, huh? Woo! Hashtag fire nice products. <laughs> Audie got new shoes yesterday. She's looking so pretty. Oh, makeup. What five year old wears makeup, girlfriend? <laughs> you girls are something else, I swear. Anyway, everyone have an awesome, blessed day. And it is going to be the best Monday ever. Bye. Right? Bye. My favorite daughter. Well, you're not my favorite daughter. You're my favorite five-year-old daughter. Because I know Starla's probably going to watch this video. What are you doing? Get out of here. Trying to kiss Can me, Dad. Can I just kiss me and get laid? <laughs>